so this is my second video regarding programming the first one was about the library database management system that I made for my first semester project using basic C++ in the second semester we studied object oriented programming I will soon upload a video of the project I did for my second semester well uh, currently I'm on summer vacation and decided to go for an internship and for my internship the company that hired me as the intern wanted me to learn the basic uh, basic Java so I have been studying this book by detail uh, Java how to program this is a good little book that I have been studying and it has been helping me a lot so I have done basic stuff I've covered around 14 chapters of this book in a week and currently I am I just completed the chapter about a uh, graphic user interface so over the weekend I decided to make a small application so here it is I have made a calculator a basic calculator like the one you have on your windows but it just performs the four basic operations like addition subtraction multiplication and division those are the operation it performs my calculator so as you can see I am not using any environment to create this not like I am not using Eclipse or anything I am just using the notepad plus plus to code my soft uh, my application and then I used a, uh, I used command prompt to actually compile the code so I have already compiled it so I will just call to call it and here it is as you can see it has a very basic graphic, graphic user interface you have your written uh, menu bar you have your buttons you can press on menu bar you have an option go here and just tells you about the calculator tells me that it has been made by me and leaves and give my email address for anyone who wants to contact me anyways so you can either press the buttons to enter the digits and then select one of the operators press more buttons and equal to will give you the answer you can clear it you can add subtract multiply or divide minus 88 uh, you can perform more than one calculations in a go 1 2 3 plus 4 5 6 plus 7 8 9 so it will give you the answer to that or you can either uh, perform calculations even on the answer or you can start all over again by just pressing the new key and it will just start again it does not follow the demand rule currently I will work on that later on and that would be the version 2 of the calculator that actually follows demand and proper mathematical rules so beside using the buttons you can use a keyboard to enter text as well you can either use the uh, numpad on your keyboard like I'm using right now press the plus key and press enter to get the result you can press backspace or escape to clear the screen or you can use the numbers on your alphanumeric pa uh, part of the keyboard to enter digits here now if you divide by zero it will give you an answer so after the, uh, an error and after that you have to clear so this is the basic calculator so I hope you like it like always if you want the code or any help regarding this you can leave a comment and I will get back to you and uh, upload the code and share with you so just leave a comment or anything or you can contact me on my email address that has been given here I will add it in the comment section on the description as well hope you like it uh, I spent like two to three hours to make this application not a big application very easy to make the only problem I had was how am I supposed to make uh, make it perform more than one um, more than one uh, calculation at a time like you can give like five calculations and then just get the answer that was the tough part I had to use arrays and work out logic to do that that is what took me the real time but besides that it's a basic very basic uh, application and well this is my first application on Java I will share more as I make more hope you like it uh, thank you for watching the video leave comment like or subscribe for more videos about programming that I'm about to make and I will soon share my second semester project as well so bye